My name is Jo Crawshaw and I uh, lead marketing and PR for the Sub-Saharan region for Opera Software. And jo, how many people are using Opera in some form in Africa at the moment? In Africa, we are now over 50 million users in total, um, and that's a, a very significant number of our entire global total. And the big countries like Nigeria, how many mm. people are using it in Nigeria? We're very close to 20 million now there. Um, okay. We're still number one browser in, in Nigeria and uh, planning to stay that way. <laughs> and what sorts of things are people doing with Opera? Because I, I tend mm. to think of it just as a web browser, but there are many mm. other things, aren't there? That it Absolutely. Does? Uh, we, we have Opera. Opera Mini is, the, is, the, is our flagship product, is our, our original product. Um, but we now like to think of ourselves not just as a browser company, but as an internet company more, more broadly. Uh, so Opera Mini is, uh, is famous for its data compression. Uh, it saves users data uh, and therefore saves them money. Uh, since uh, then, we've actually launched a product called WebPass. Yeah. Uh, now WebPass allows operators to package data in a completely different way. So originally, and what we're all used to is buying bundles in megabytes and gigabytes, mm. and nobody really knows what that means. No, you, you know, have how, no idea whether how much you've got left. No or, idea, yeah. and 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 you know, if if we don't know, and we work in the industry, then yeah. someone that's never been online before in Africa, they have no idea either. So, it, with WebPass, you can actually package the data in terms of time-based bundles yeah. or content. So you could get an hour of Facebook or a day of internet. And that way, for the, for the users themselves, that gives them control over what they're using. Mm. Um, it takes away some of the fear of possibly having a, uh, you know, airtime that might get eaten up. Yeah, you can um, fix the sum in advance. Exactly, you can fix yeah. it in advance. You know exactly how much money you're paying and yeah. what you're getting for it. And, uh, and for the operators, this is a way for them to attract a whole new uh, market of people who perhaps have never been online before. And, uh, and that's something that we're, uh, we're, we're rolling out with a few operators now and it's, uh, it's a really exciting product for us. And what is Opera Max? Opera Max is a, um, it takes our famous compression technology but it goes a whole, whole step, step further. further. So originally with Opera Mini we compress uh, pictures and we compress text. Yeah. With Opera Max, it is actually an application that sits on your phone and it compresses everything that goes through your phone, all of your applications. And uh, it allows the consumer to see exactly what is taking up how much data. It's almost like a Facebook and timeline, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's, a, it's, it's a fantastic way of, of being able to actually have, again, control and see, mm. see where you're using data. And a lot of the time, I've found it's strange apps that you wouldn't necessarily know. Mm. Uh, are using think, all that data. Exactly, and they're sitting in the background, and yeah. they're and they're they're having a, a you know a little bit of a problem. Mm. Uh, they're causing problems for people that you know haven't got that much money to spend. Yeah. So that's currently available on Android, and uh, and we're launching it with different uh, handset manufacturers and OEMs across uh, across the continent at the moment. And you're also beginning to focus on video compression now. Aren't mm. you? Yeah, and this, this is a, a really exciting for us. Um, I think, especially in a market like Africa, where you have millions and millions of people in Nigeria watching the Nollywood movies, mm. and primarily, the vast majority are watching them on mobile. With our video compression, um, which is now included on our Opera Mini for iOS as mm. well, that launched this week, our new version, people can actually watch videos that are compressed. We call it Video Boost. And uh, when you have a, a handset, you don't necessarily need to watch in a, in a full HD. Mm. Uh, so it, it recognizes your phone and, and, what, and, the, and you have control over it still. Mm. But uh, it, it, it gives you a chance to actually be able to um, watch that video without any, any worry that it's going to mm. eat all of your data up in one go. You joined Opera not so long ago and mm. you've been traveling a great deal mm. across Africa. What are the things that have struck you most in, in your travels? Um, I think, first of all, uh, the massive Android growth. Um, the, the, there's a huge number of people now coming onto, onto smartphone devices, the entry-level smartphones, and, uh, and it's fantastic. We're seeing on our, on our user base, uh, our Java, Java users are still very strong here, mm. but our Android users are increasing every day. And that's, uh, that's been a fantastic uh, thing to, to see mm. actually happen and as, as smartphone penetration mm. increases.